Hi, for those who are clicking in on the first time, this is the Hero's Journey with Dr. D, here to encourage, to inspire, to motivate, and educate, helping you get beyond your first move and creating a better mindset today. If you find any value in this content, go ahead. Help me help you so we can help others by liking, by clicking the thumbs up and sharing. What you do is you join with me and climb with me as we try to make a better tomorrow today. And currently what we do, we upload a fresh video every week, once a week. And we do a live stream on Wednesdays and a replay with a live chat on Thursday. And also you can click down below and we cover all the major podcasts and click the link and find your podcast so you can listen while you drive to and from work. Now enjoy the video. For the first time, um, this is Hero's Journey with Dr. D and tonight is, tonight is um, the, re the recap, the up and coming and the Q&A. And the Q&A, thank you. It's a Q&A session. And what we're doing to QA, the, the recap, recap the update and the Q&A on is, it's the last uh, um, video of Mass Men Wear. Uh, Mass Men Wear, um, the, the last portion, the last part of the three part series of what we are, uh, what we are discussing is, uh, we're talking about invincibility. We talk about the mask of knowing it all, and we really don't. And we talked about the mask of the alpha male. Dun, 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 dun. And why can't we just be better men, right? All right, so what I'm going to do is just do a recap. And for those who are uh, in the chat line right now, just go ahead and put your uh, your chats in the, in the chat section. And, and go ahead and give me a thumbs up while you're doing it at the same time. And also, for those who are out of the country, um, uh, go ahead and forward. The, I'm going to forward the uh, Anchor app so you can get in on the audio when we do the Q&A sessions. Uh, just send me a chat in the chat line and um, and I'll, I'll send you a link. Okay. All right. The recap. All right. We talked about invincibility. Okay. Men. All right. Cool, Paul. Um, and Phil, if you can just uh, copy uh, copy uh, Paul of the um, if you can, if you can copy Paul of the the link so she can forward to Andy. Appreciate it. All right, so let's get started. All right, so um, invincibility. We talk about invincibility, invincibility, knowing it all, and alpha male. I I wrapped it up. I did it pretty simply is of that when we grow up, I used a couple of examples in the video about growing up invincible. We all, we had put on a mask, whether it's male or female, we put on a mask when we was younger and whether we was dealing with abuse, uh, uh, frustration in school, or if we just trying to pick an image that we can be looked up to or that we don't have to be afraid of our mirror, uh, ourselves in the mirror. So either male, it doesn't really matter. But we talk about masks that men wear. But sometimes women take that mask on as well. And usually a lot of times, I know I'm shifting a little bit. A lot of times when women take over the mask, they take over masculine qualities of invincibility and being hard and stern because they're putting up a wall. And that that's that's the same thing that goes for men. Now we're going back to men. Um, they put up a wall. They put up walls so they can protect themselves. And the reason why they want to protect themselves is because a lot of times they really don't know who they are. And and unfortunately, as it may seem, parents, uh, even the good ones, um, uh, generally uh, make the television the babysitter. And if the television and the radio is the babysitter, who's teaching the lesson for the day? The television and the radio. But not just the television and radio because that's just the item. But who's putting information in the television and radio? Because they're doing that so they can push a agenda for the bottom line. Whether they're selling candy, whether they're selling toys, they're selling cars, they're selling clothes, they're selling makeup. The underline, they're selling sex, so they're selling violence. This, but if it sells, they don't care what they're selling, who they hurt. 
a lot of eyes are coming coming through the radio, coming through um, the television, and they're feeding, uh, they're creating a tangible image internally in your child. And we all we all have been children, so that internal the internal image that was created grew with us, and sometimes we didn't take the mask off when we realized that mask just was there just to help us help us through a situation through a friendship through a uh, relationship uh, through a bad upbringing so we sometimes we get the heart of being invincible and men do that i mean especially with football and, and hard sports we we get on there and we become invincible because you know that's what strength for men got to be strong and powerful yeah but when do you take it off and I talk about that in the in the video. Um, when do you take it off? And that's the question. And that's the thing. And I've stated this, I stated this before, I'll state it again. Items, um, masks are good for seasons in our life to protect us and keep us safe from the things that are out of our control. That's why some people have imaginary friends. Probably because they don't have any. But when they start carrying the imaginary friend to their 40 and 50, then there's an issue. Because the, the imaginary friend was just a part of a mask for a certain time that was needed. I'm just saying. All right, so that's the sensibility. Then we talked about, uh, then we talked about the know it all. You know, you know, I got a lot of smart people online. <laughs> a lot of smart people online. And well, I got a PhD. I never really thought I was the, the a brainiac. No, no, I didn't. I really didn't. But <laughs> in some cases, I thought I knew it all. Like I stated in the video, while it's intentional, it's an unintended uh, ad, um, behavior that I was giving off for telling people, I know, I know, I know. It still was a know-it-all attitude. And what I was doing is I was protecting my ego. I, I know, I know, no. Because unconsciously, the the know-it-all person, the mask was like, oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. So he gave you a little hint. So therefore, a person gave you a hint. You say, I know, I know, I know. So therefore, you knew, you knew it all before. But I really didn't. Why can't we just know something? I want to take full credit for it. And when we ask somebody for something, why can't we just say, man, thanks. I really appreciate you going out your way to give me the information that I needed. While at the same time, while they start to talk, you start to remember. But see, that was not your own doing. That person, that other item on the outside triggered that. So we need to be more appreciative to others instead of focus on us alone. I think that goes to male or female. Then you have the, uh, um, then we have the the mask of the alpha. <laughs> you get alpha, alpha uh, I, I use example Rambo, Commando, you know all the action figures. You know they they can, they can oh the um, transporter. Oh he's oh, he's straight up alpha male. He don't make expressions. He beat everybody up. Oh that's sweet. We we, we grew up on that. We grew up on. That's the uh, the thing that you're supposed to be an alpha. You know, you don't feel no pain. You can go through anything. That's why a lot of men they don't want to. They want to be a Navy SEAL, but they don't want to go through the torture. They want to be a, they want to be a ranger, but they they don't want to they don't want to go through the torture. The mental is more it's more mental than physical, but it's when the mental meets the physical. I have a friend who's a who's a SEAL, and he told me. He said, after, after a while, it's, see, when people say when you, you're almost through, you, it gets better, it gets easier, they lie. He said, they lie. But what happens is your mind takes you to a different plateau where you just phase. You just phase to a different phase, mind over matter. You've told yourself that, no, this is only for a little while, and you move past that. It's mental. Mental. A lot of things that we do is mental. As a man thinketh, so is he. But the point, the thing here, the issue is that a lot of times we don't think that much. 
we let other people think for us and plant seeds to grow in our minds, dictating our path. That's television. That's radio. Oh, yeah, I've been, I've been there as well. <laughs> I've been there as well. So I work constantly trying to evolve and trying to reflect on what I'm listening to and what, I, what I'm seeing and how it's affecting the way I do things. It's all about discipline. All right. So that's my recap. <laughs> now, that's my recap and my update is that um, I'm, I'm still deliberating I'm deliberating I have a video I was going to continue on the series of masks and do the mask in the workplace uh, give me a thumbs up or, or alternative um, uh, videos that you think would be a good idea you can put it in the chat section I'm listening I'm listening and um, or I was going to do the video um uh, in another person's moccasins. I okay. Um the the moccasins. Um while I was gonna do living somebody else's moccasins. I'm still uh, was trying to deliberate a, a specific title. I mean uh Phil gave me a good good topic uh good topic and um and I, I may run with it, but I still deliberate between uh, continuing the series of masks in the workplace because while we all work, uh, while we don't work, uh, while we all work in some form of fashion, um, man, we sell. If we're selling items, we don't like people. We have to put on mask on because we want to do the purchase. We don't want anybody to buy a product for us to, to run for the hills. We put on certain masks. But um, that's the that's the up and coming. Now, um, this is the Q and A, Q and A. Now I'm over in the chat section. Now let now let me know in the chat section if things are flowing better. And I sent everybody. Uh, I sent. Oh, I just didn't follow the link. Uh, I go see. Uh, let me see. Let me send Paula generate link copy link. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, I don't have, I don't have Paula messenger. I don't see. All right. Uh, first question: Why did you include? Why did you include the know it all with the others? Because it's one of my masks. <laughs> That's why I did. I mean, it's still, it's one of the masks. I mean, a lot of times, I mean, we can be argumentative when we feel like we know something versus the other person. And some may add that women may feel may feel the exact same way. It may be a back and forth. But we can get pretty, um, and I used the example of know-it-all because I didn't think I was um, ornery. So to speak, when when I was repetitively saying I know it all, when my best friend actually told me, "Man, stop saying you know it all," because people won't tell you anything because you know it all. I'm putting life into something, into an opinion of others. All right, all right, hide on stream. All right. All right. Uh, first question: Why did you include? Why did you include the know it all with the others? Because it's one of my masks. <laughs> That's why I did. I mean, it's still, it's one of the masks. I mean, a lot of times, I mean, we can be argumentative when we feel like we know something versus the other person. And some may add that women may feel may feel the exact same way. It may be a back and forth, but we can get pretty. Um, and I used the example of know it all because I didn't think I was um ornery, so to speak, when when I was repetitively saying I know it all. When my best friend actually told me, "Man, stop saying you know it all," because people won't tell you anything because you know it all. I'm putting life into something. Into an opinion of others. All right. Uh, so, 
کنید alright I don't stream I'm, I'm trying to put the next one I don't see you say Philip you say I don't see how the know it all and the machismo uh, could be in the same sentence hmm I don't okay I think Paul is pretty much it that uh, tell me uh, have uh, anybody received give, uh, give me a response have anybody received the links to come on I don't think uh, he was saying it's a mess because it protects the ego and the wear of mask to protect the insecure, his insecurities all of it well, Paul, all of it protects the ego. All of it protects the ego. I mean, whether you talk about uh, uh, you talk about sexuality, you talk about uh, alpha, you talk about uh, athletic. It's all it all protects the ego, right? Because you said, because Phil, you're saying that it it why cannot blend it? I mean, because we we all, we're all multifaceted creatures. I mean, even. Even a good master mask. Mm. Yeah, just because the just because the mask don't mean it's bad. It's just when you you on delusion, the mask is actually you. <laughs> That's yeah. what like. Yeah. Yeah. The mask doesn't have to be bad. Right. Right. Most of them are civil. It's like when you go to church, you can't say all of the bad words you want to when you would be at home. Right. <laughs> So you, you yeah, Paula, Paula, Paula wish she get what well, Paula wish she till she get in the car and then let's rip. Mm -hmm. And I've done it to my shrinks too. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't give me enough drugs for that mess. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody had to let them know y'all need to give me more if you expect me to drive through Kidston. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah. That's a scary town now. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, what, what what else you say, Phil? You said um. Oh, she's back. She's here. Uh, Phil said, I was accused of being the know-it-all in school just because I did my homework. See, I'm with you, Phil. Phil, you did your homework? <laughs> I always did my homework. Don't they? <laughs> You notice who's here tonight, right? Two doing their homework. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you well, you was accused of being a know it all for doing your homework. He did know it all, is what he's saying. Yeah, because, because I had a, a classmate that said, I think you know everything because the teacher was asking a question. Okay. And you actually participating. You actually trying to learn something. Mm -hmm. I was the know it all just like that, but I still think I was smarter than most of them too. So no, without, I don't know it all, but I know a lot. I think in my well, reading it, it's a class in my first year of college. I I didn't know it all, but I would um I would listen to everything the teacher uh, the teacher said. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I put it together and she asked a question. I really didn't know it. I just pulling. I was pulling. Yeah. So I get around about asking. Now I get it. I remember one time I was wrong. This boy about fell out the chair and rolled. Because <laughs> you were wrong chair. once? Yeah, because <laughs> in his mind, he think he know everything. And then while I was wrong, I guess he felt like, ha, ha, ha. Know it all, don't know it. See, I'll admit when I'm wrong. It's not often, but I'll admit it. <laughs> it. It was no big deal. I was trying. Right. I was try it was no big deal that he laughed at me, but you know, that's just that's him. Mm -hmm. I was trying. He was probably a D student too. <laughs> you know, sometimes people people want to be shown up. I was one it's of girls those, in the classroom. I, mean, I was an intellectual snob. I mean. I hate to admit it, but I what? But I was smart, like at nine or ten years old. God. I oh, so you like my twins. It's, it's, go ahead. 
Can you hear me? Okay. Perfectly. We get we about that school example again. School? You had people who, yeah, they knew the answer, but, but they didn't be smart, so they wore a mask that, for, for ignorance reasons. I don't know, so the class doesn't know, so I don't know either. Right, right. Because nobody wants to be the outcast. Because it's not cool to be smart. And you just showing off. So, no, right. And that's what I keep getting at when I keep saying, okay, you're putting that in there too. And sometimes it isn't that I'm the know it all because I did my homework. Yeah, okay. Let's, let's run with that. I did my homework or. An issue. I look. I went to a library and found out, or maybe I asked my parents or somebody else that. So because I'm now educating, you making me feel like oh I have to be act like I don't know. Yeah, I think look, you are looking in other context. Okay, you were significant other having a uh, conversation. She's trying to express how she feels. You cut her off in the midst of her talking. And, she, oh, yeah, see, such, such, this, such, such, that, such, such, this. See, no. If you let me finish, you get the rest of the facts. Oh, I don't need that you finish. I know what you're going to say. Because you always say it. If you let me finish, Cause you, or you, so you know everything. You know everything about women, right? All right. See, that's the problem. I can't talk to you because you know it all. And that what what stops communication, effective communication, is when the other party, whether it's, whether it's in a relationship or whether it's uh, over a platform or whether it's in a business meeting, it doesn't matter. But other party is thinking that they the cream of the crop and they really the mud the mud of the uh, mud of the swamp like a person up there speaking they, they just going to or like the american idols up <laughs> yeah like, okay you see american idols uh the competition they get up there yeah they start singing ah, ah. yeah that was good was it simon was it that was the bomb and then they said you had a sweetheart, you had a good beginning. Yeah, but it's a little pitchy. You don't know what you're talking about. I've been singing since I was five years old. Shoot, everybody love to hear me sing. I can sing. If you if you look, I'm trying to give you some advice to work on. You don't give me no advice. Who are you? Shoot, I know I can sing, right, mama? My mama said I can sing. My daddy loved the way I sang. Everybody loved the way I sang. <laughs> But she sound she sound like crap because she know it all. Or maybe she sound like crap. It sounded right. Maybe she doesn't need to do forty gospels. Maybe she need to uh, uh, slowly speak her words so you could appreciate the song. Now, but it wasn't about the words. It's just the pictures off. The okay. pictures off. It's like. Um, yeah, you need to get some lessons. And your your pitching means that your, your tune's off. It's supposed to be B, you, but you're in a D flat, and you didn't know, and, and you didn't know you 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 think you're the cream of the crop. You wasn't doing the runs. You just think you cream of the crop, man. Ah, ah, and that's why I sound like ah. That's somebody screaming. But some people can listen to constructive criticism and take the feedback. And it's okay. Okay, I haven't heard I haven't heard that um explain explained like that before. So if they haven't heard it explained like that before, then they will um uh then they'll then then they'll take ear to the the, the criticism or the feedback. But see, but know it all you can't tell anything. Because a know all is synonymous to a narcissistic, uh, a person with narcissistic uh, disposition. 
like for it's like why give example why I give the example in the um why I give the example in the video about I was a know I was a, a malevolent or malicious know it all but I thought I knew it all and within the context of me asking for information so I'm asking for information the person gives me information that I didn't know but in that context I knew it all but he started this I know I know I know no he just triggered a memory because I didn't know at the beginning because if I knew at the beginning I never asked and if you can acknowledge that you don't know everything then if you knew something a person can help you know more if you listen that's why God gave us two more, or more ears than a mouth but we choose to use this more that may, I understand you saying like know it all in a classroom but within the context of um, I think it's more a context in a relationship whatever relationship father trying to tell son it's an instructor I don't need to hear you old man but you can't tell me nothing for instance like um, I, I heard something today Brian McKnight did a, a, a PSA about his sons he said um, his kids not his sons he said they're they're entitled he said, I, he said, I take the blame because I gave them everything that they wanted. and But I gave them two years. I said, after two years, they're going to have to um, get a place of your own. He said, I, I stop them. Um, he stopped being uh, uh, the free check. He wanted them to, uh, he, he wanted them to pay, um, you know, to earn the keep. Now they start they start crying because they 30 years old. And they start saying he ain't nothing, he ain't never did nothing for us. But one of the sons, he had three cars before he turned 16 or 18. Free. But some kids they say they know it all. They know what's right for them, but they never lived the life before. And that go all goes into they they take they take they they've been drinking the Kool-Aid somebody else is feeding him. And you know what happened when, when the people in Ghana they drink the Kool-Aid that somebody else force fed them. They all die. And then a lot of times if you you die inside to the person you actually are, if you know it all. That makes sense? It's perfect sense. But there's this other question I have. It's always I guess I'm staying on this quite a bit. Um, in the workplace, we've been in situations where, okay, I was in a meeting one time mm -hmm. and we were all asked to give ideas and suggestions about a particular project, a new product that was being launched. And the idea that the uh, management had, it was so ridiculous to me. And I don't say that like, okay, I'm just wonderful and great, but it was ridiculous in that it didn't take into account certain things. And my being one of the frontline workers, I could tell them that's not gonna work. We can't do A, B, and C, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. And so they were, they were like, well, you know, one of my managers told me, well, you know, she has an A from so-and-so school. And I said, no, that doesn't mean that she's not I mean, wrong. Right. Was she cute? And, <laughs> uh, wasn't approachable, put it that way. But was she cute? This NBA from Austin. One more time. The cute where the cuteness wears off when you when you stop being approachable. I'm not okay, listening but, but to did, you. Did, <laughs> but did the manager think that he may have had a shot? Yeah, that's a that, yeah, that is a good point. But I think the point I'm is you know the, uh, and I hope that you, you do go to the series on work uh, place mass. 
Because you've had situations, you know, people and ideas and, and stuff, or they might tell their bosses no to a certain, but you know, the boss wants to say, oh, we hired a consultant. Well, I can tell you, I've worked in that every day. Why do you, I, you hired a consultant to tell you that that machine is broke? <laughs> I walk past the machine every day, it's broke, you know. <laughs> <laughs> they had a budget though well you could have spent it on yeah. raises or bonuses, uh, not you know hiring this consultant just because well you know you know there's a lot of times the consultant is their cousin <laughs> yeah you know like government had a lot of consultants that mm -hmm. um, just slip on the bone they will, oh yeah, we need to hire this consultant. And it's in a budget, so you know, it's free money. It's free money. Yeah, you're right. I mean, you got a point. Yeah, but something. But we don't. You sometimes you don't know what goes on on uh, the, the the rationale, the reason behind a person's um, decisions. You just dare get a check. Yeah. And, and not. Mm -hmm. you know, I'll just say that when I was twenty two. I might have gave a lot of opinions, and nowadays I just listen to certain stuff and just not waste my breath. Right. But but now is it different? Is it not now? What's that different? You, what's that you drinking? Prove it. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it to me. What's that? Vodka. Oh, straight. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Vodka with no alcohol. That's right. Okay, but before you tell me you got to go, I, I something you said tonight, and I kind of want you to go back to his own for this part. Uh, about the relation, when you talked about relations, and you're not listening i'm trying to say this you know dude I have to listen to somebody say they trying something for 20 minutes you don't listen you don't listen mm -hmm. i want you to hurry up and say it <laughs> get this point across <laughs> don't argue with me for not listening I'm listening to you now, and you listening to me about I'm not listening. <laughs> What's the question? I had a mask on then, too. <laughs> well, 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 yeah, but it's um, the mask was a mask of um, well, you want to be more authentic when you you want to try. Doesn't you got to put a mask on until you grow into? You want to try when you get in communication with somebody you actually want to understand. Now, if you care nothing, nothing about the person, oh. yeah. But if you actually care about the person, it, it will make it better for you because if you can actually hear the person, then it's less time bonds you're walking into because you heard the person. But if you repetitively, if you keep on the exact same thing over and over again, expect different results. Well, Einstein said that's the definition of insanity. He said you always fussing, but I told you the other day. You said you was listening, right? Yeah, I was listening. I just didn't hear you. <laughs> That'd be probably the honest response. I was listening. I just didn't hear you. Or yeah, you right. You right. Yep, you right. You right. You right. Oh, you've been listening to Kevin, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You right. You, you right. <laughs> yeah. You right. Mm. You right. Mm. You right. <laughs> no, but think sometimes you yeah, like when I get communication with my significant others, sometimes it gets paused. And probably because 
she's trying to take the time to be deliberate in her words. And that's appreciated now. So that you wish you go a little faster. But <laughs> you can understand. <laughs> How can two walk together unless they agree? <laughs> you can agree to disagree, but you at least need to understand what you're disagreeing about. So you can be distinct on your decisions. Okay, family rose, gotcha. Uh she said gotcha. Paul said family rose. I know what that means. <laughs> uh-huh. Um so so you have to be is a is a clarity. You it is a process too, because you understand you're somebody else and they're not you. They didn't raise up they wasn't raised up the same house, they didn't sleep in the same bed, eat the same counter, and don't know your mama that well. So you know, <laughs> they're knowing your mama. Yeah, the okay, couple on the screen shaking hands, they agree with you. <laughs> okay, <laughs> the couple they agree with me. Okay, that's good. That's good. So I mean, so that's that's always a process. I'm, I still learn. I learn every day because that's why I have to constantly reflect on what you see in the chat. I gotta get some dolls. <laughs> He's back. Okay. Okay, Paula. Let me let me see, Paula. I will see. If she, I will see. If she will pop back up. I will, okay. So, okay. So I was playing things about about the relationship stuff, and uh, so I gotta get some dolls. That that those dolls are funny. Um. So you got visibility. Oh. <laughs> Uh, the bobbleheads, bobble pimp, and his bottom. <laughs> they were doing the electric slide. Okay. <laughs> okay, I got you. All right, so we got so invincibility. I said invincibility, know it all, and you get on um, know it all in the alpha. So I explained everything. Any more questions? That's it for tonight. Oh, very brief. I'm a girl. Did <laughs> Paula said <laughs> I'm a girl. <laughs> I'm a girl and they're dials. I do have <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, Paula, what's your future? Uh, she has a. I do have a future. Okay, what is it? I did for cast. I do have an idea for your future cast. Okay. You know what subject I'm dealing with. Perhaps something about those. Oh. What subject I'm dealing with. Perhaps something along those lines. Dealing with someone else's addiction issues. That's a good one. What would be a title? Phil, you got an idea for a title? Uh, I'm not sure about that one, but I had an idea too. Okay, tips to help us make it through and help rather than harm the other person. Hmm. That's a good one. Can you hear okay, me? Got... Yeah, okay, what's yours? Mine was to do walking in somebody else's shoes. Walk somebody else's moccasins. Moccasins. Yeah. I stated that. Uh yours was tip to help us make it through. I like that. Um right. I I stated that uh in my in the update. I like that uh, I'm deliberating um doing that or doing uh the last one of uh ma mask in the workplace for this week do them both and then that do both do that one first and then do whatever other ideas afterward yeah okay so th there it is so i do i do mask in the workplace i'm think i'm gonna give me another um 
do the mask and replay. Give me another mask and I'm gonna switch switch up my uh my thumbnail. And that that'd be the end of that one. And um yeah, that'd be that'd be end uh end of that one. Finish mask, then next topic. Yeah, Paulie, I was finished. But <laughs> mask. Uh, well, I'm gonna do a mask in the workplace, and then I'll do the next topic. Uh, I like both of y'all's uh, tips on how to uh, affect you deal with that person and um, uh, living somebody else's moccasin. They kind of, they kind of go together. They kind of go together. I think the dealing with effectively deal with somebody else's uh, addiction because people don't realize the person when one person's addiction in the house, the whole house is addicted. And sometimes the person not even in the house. If they're connected with you in a close relationship, meaning that either their spouse or a child or close relatives, you experience that. Maybe not a direct effect, but affect all the same. So yeah, that's that's worth dealing. That's my area too. So hmm. Hmm. things to make you go. Hmm. Huh? Huh, huh. All right. All hearts and minds clear. Can I bring all my people to side? Yeah, I'm going to use this too. You go ahead. Oh, never mind. I'm not doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Why not? <laughs> Why? <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm bringing some dollars. Uh, Paula says she brings some dollars next time. It's, it's been a doll competition. <laughs> There's not. Stop calling them dolls. Well, Paula's, Paula's been a girl long, uh, long, longer than we have, so I think she got a. Oh, Lord. Yeah, Paula. You see the chat? You see the chat? What'd she say? I'm bringing a nude doll. What'd she say? I'm bringing a nude doll. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know how to, uh, uh, what do you call it? I don't know how to, uh, I don't know how to censor yet. <laughs> what do y'all do? It's called cut. <laughs> Bill and Jada, eat your heart out. I would get my own, but I got I gotta wait a little while. They, they cost the, the the design, the um, the one you get the one design like you. They cost a little bit. I thought about twenty dollars. No, they cost a piece. Okay, right. the no crack in the bobbleheads. Oh wait, 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 wait. Toppers anyway. You know they're not anatomically correct. Oh, like Barbie. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Let me let me co uh, complete my my spiel. <laughs> All right. Okay. Hey, journeyman, journey women. Uh, thank you. I really appreciate you coming joining uh, joining me out. Uh, all all our travelers coming out to join with me on the Heroes Update Live, uh, talking about invincibility and being a know it all. And the alpha male, and this will end the mask, the mask men wear series. And next week, we'll continue on with the mask in the workplace. However, if you find any value in this content, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Uh, give me a thumbs up, but help me help you, uh, so we can help others. Uh, so, so we can help others by liking and commenting and sharing and sharing and sharing, so we can climb together. And so we climb together and. So we can make it better tomorrow, uh, today. And with that, with that being said, <laughs> with, with, with that being said, I would like for everybody to have a, have a great night and peace and peace and blessing. Every day you get a vertical, make it your golden life <laughs> to always move forward and never look back. So peace and blessings. And this is a hero journey with Doctor D, and we are out. Put it in.